Yo, what's good guys? It is your boy Jason JV saying welcome to another uh, WWE 2K22 My Rise video. And yeah, y'all. Um, so something that I'm noticing, um, I have a story on Raw that is locked. And it is the last story. And I was looking up on how to open it. Apparently, I'm not the only one that's having this, issues, this issue. Uh, there's other players in the community that are having the same problem. Um tried everything that they did I tried uh, not being champion um, I tried being champion again I tried uh, being heel I tried being babyface there's no way to unlock to unlock this last story I don't know if it's uh, a glitch or if it's cut content you know what I mean content that they just cut out like the very last second and didn't you know remove that story altogether so uh, I guess I don't know I'm gonna just, I've heard some people talk about, oh, playing through SmackDown all the way through and then possibly coming back to Raw. But then, I don't know. I've heard people say that they did that, but they still can unlock that story. So, I don't know. We'll play through all the SmackDown. I heard SmackDown, there are some issues with that, too. Like, there's a locked story on SmackDown. I guess we'll find out um, if we had the same problem on SmackDown like that we do with Raw. Um, that concerns a story not being unlockable. Um, again, I don't know if that's some kind of glitch that 2K needs to patch. And the thing that irritates me about this whole thing in regards to my rise, we had people in the community, right, that were, that were invited to 2K's headquarters. They had an opportunity to test out the my rise story and everything. And nobody thought to check the my rise stuff to make sure we wouldn't have any problems oh but no they they, they didn't want to be spoiled they, they didn't want to spoil themselves with the story even though they, they signed an nda so they couldn't spoil anything for the rest of us so yeah congratulate congratulations you um early access noble warriors um by not spoiling yourselves, you kind of spoil the game for the rest of us. Because now we, we have these issues, you know what I mean, that we could certainly do without. Female My Rise, there was no problems at all. I was able to access all the stories and all the brands and then call it call it a, a, a career after that point. You know what I mean? Now here we are in the male My Rise. And we're having all kinds of glitch issues. We're, we're having, you know, glitch issues with our facial hair on our creative character. We're having um, now stories that we can't even get access to so yeah appreciate y'all trying to be noble not spoiling the yeah, stuff for yourself but i mean think about it though when you have early access to a game you should have tested everything but no you want to play exhibition matches you want to check gm mode that was the only mode that y'all care to check but you didn't care to check freaking my rise to make sure that it was all systems go there bruh you know, invite in 2K. Invite me to your headquarters. I will check everything. I will, I will go through your next game with a fine tooth comb to make sure that everything on that thing works. I'm just saying, man. This is some 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 BS. Anyway, rant over. Let's go ahead and get into this next video. You know what one of my favorite sounds in the world is? Hearing the crack of a kendo stick over someone's back. I heard it at the first event I went to, and it's stuck with me ever since. I would love to see how vicious you could be with a kendo stick in your hand. So, make that kendo stick crack on a pollo's back. So, are we find another chicken? <laughs> You're kidding! <laughs> I guess we shall see if we find another wrestler in a chicken suit or something, because it says a pollo. Or is it Apollo? Oh, so it's Apollo. Okay. Hey, calm me down, Rose, Apollo. I don't know what you think this is, but, uh, yeah, you don't get to jump on me. Uh, I need to whoop your ass with a Kindle stick. I'll be right back. Damn it. Why is that the break when I have only one more shot left? What the hell, man? What the hell? And now we good. Oh, 
Um, okay, why can I not take the toppings off of the SmackDown table? Get your ass up. Maybe you're in the way. Get over there. There we go. That's what it was. He was in the way. Oh hell. No. Let me go. Asshole. We got enough for a save, which will, and hopefully we can nail it so we can get a finisher. Dunskis. Here is your winner, the outlaw, Jason J. V. And apparently another table broke. I wonder if these patches they put out have anything to do with these issues with these stories. Candlestick Carnage is complete. And that turned us heel. Fantastic. I love the New Day and Big E. But when I've had a bad day, I don't want to see the powerhouse of positivity. I want to see carnage. Like they say, misery loves company. Figured you'd be the guy to talk to about bringing Big E some misery. Dude, hasn't Big E suffered enough? I mean, the guy has a broken neck. Now y'all want me to attack him because he deserves it? Come on now. This game could be cold-blooded at times, man. I'm telling you. All right, Biggie. It's not personal, man. I promise. I promise it's not personal. It's just business. Since there are no rules, anything can be used as a weapon against your opponent. Anything can be used. Adrenaline makes you do crazy things. I don't know. Will Smith taught me that. Love will make you do crazy things. <laughs> what the hell do I know? Or what the hell does he know? <laughs> to the table. Yeah. Damn, yeah, right with authority. You can see as he rises, how vulnerable of a position he's in. Crap. Go through the table. Yeah. And I think it showed up on the screen. Let me get this table. Come on, Biggie. Follow me. Hey. You mind? I need this table for something. Looks like he has something planned with his table, guys. Oh yes, we do. And uh, climb, climb. Oh, you can tell oh, he's feeling it now. This Come on, Biggie. We're gonna have some fun. We're gonna have some fun. Trust me, you're, you're gonna love this. Come on. Strictly meant for loading and maintenance. You need professional clearance to be up there. No, I don't think they care about any clearance. When there's this much animosity, you'll take every to the table. To punch your oh, and it knocked him out. Let's go. It didn't show it though. It was so brutal. They couldn't show it. So misery loves company is complete. I love that so many WWE superstars care so much about the world and their communities. 
Speaking of, are you entering the upcoming SmackDown Gives Back Charity Battle Royal? Uh, it's gonna make us face, so I mean, I guess. Big E! Hey! No! Uh uh! No! What the hell? No! Dude, Big E is trying to eliminate us and you turned away from him. Why would you do that? Please explain why did you. I'm actually getting some assistance here. Thank ya. But, uh, you kinda need to go too. See ya! Oh, that's Morrison? And we busted him open. I didn't recognize him at first. His hair's too light. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Later, Morrison. The sound of this crowd is deafening. And he wants to the roll. John Morrison has been Oh shit, no. No! No! And that's gonna jam Cesaro. Punk ass Cesaro? You were just stunned a little while ago. You're next. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Get the hell out of here. Weren't you released anyway? Not okay! Smackdown gets back complete. We're back to being a face. You know what my favorite part of my job as a WWE cameraman is? When I get the perfect angle of amazing move from a WWE superstar. I, I share all my favorite shots online. I love to update my social media with your finisher. Would you indulge me? I mean, I guess. So, okay. You give us uh, repeated carryover fucking stories that were in the female My Rise. But yet, somehow with the male My Rise, we have a locked story on Raw that we cannot access. Oh, God. I kind of wish I had a job as a video game tester. Because I would love to have tested this game. I'm thinking, man, well, probably what I should have done is I should have came to SmackDown first, then went to Raw after we completed everything on NXT. Because SmackDown has the most stories, so I think it would have made more sense to get the bigger show out of the way first as far as like the amount of stories that it has. Then take on the smaller show afterwards. Dustin Morrison open again. Ow. This is where endurance becomes so important stages of the match. And now he's on the downside. He's got that determined look now. Damn it, stay down. We could have had a sick right there. You calm your damn rolls. Just muscling up their opponent. Alright, we got a finisher. Let's do this. This is Morrison's perseverance getting tested. Perfect shot complete. I've been watching a lot of vintage Jeff Hardy matches lately. Everyone talks about what he can do on a ladder, but his steel cage matches are also beyond. Think you could take him in a cage? It would be a dream matchup. And I owe Jeff a beatdown for when he teamed up with Cameron Grimes on NXT. Jeff is undergoing a flashy. Hardy's being 
subjugated to a beatdown. Yeah, I haven't forgotten about NXT, Jeff. Hardy uncaged complete. I'm a huge fan of Japanese wrestling. Strong style for life? <laughs> Get it? Because of my social media name, Mark for Life. Never mind. Do you think you could beat Shinsuke Nakamura in a strong style match? There's something about matches that are all about hard hitting, gritty physicality. So, strong style rules. Attempt to defeat Shinsuke. By knockout or submission only with no top rope dives allowed. Well, ain't that some shit? Well, then we can do a squash match then. So, strongest of strong, story complete. Let's see. Are we done with locations? Okay, we're done with the luxury hotel. Let's check the pool hall. I have an interesting offer for you, if you'll just hear me out. Um, go on. Okay, I'm intrigued. As you know, Bobby Lashley and I are WWE's top power couple. And after careful consideration, we've decided to expand our influence by becoming a power trio. Hmm. A power trio, huh? And you're considering me? Yes, and don't get any ideas about the two of us. Your role would be strictly business. My relationship with Bobby outside the ring is rock solid. It's simply a way for the three of us to team up and use our combined talents to get ahead in WWE. And you want to answer right now? Yes, there's no room for indecisiveness in this situation. We want someone on our side who knows what they want. And I can totally tell that Dana is reading her lines. I mean, that just came across as someone who's actually reading their shit rather than trying to act. <laughs> I'm sorry. Bruh. But uh, accept offer, harshly reject them, politely back out of the situation. I've seen people accept the offer. I wonder what happens if you reject them. Honestly, this whole thing is kind of weird. I don't know why you picked me, but I'm definitely not interested. So good luck finding someone else to complete your power trio. Wow, talk about being short-sighted. But I'm glad this didn't work out because clearly you're not worthy of being affiliated with us. Uh, 30 seconds ago, I was your top choice. <laughs> but okay, I'll be sure to let everyone know to steer clear of you two wackos. <laughs> And I'll be sure to let Bobby know everything you just said. He's not going to react too kindly. Power trio. So, okay, this triggered a... This is going to trigger a different kind of story. I'm intrigued now. I, I don't, Like I said, everyone else that I've seen play this, they've accepted. I, I don't think I've seen anyone reject them. Like, What's that? Grand Metal Elite? Uh-oh. Match just started. I only got one move in. Oh, here comes Dana Brooke. The Grand Metal League's opponent doesn't look too happy to see her. No. Just no. Nope. On Metal League. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Maybe it's because the low volume on the commentating. But it's not like Michael Cole said, "Oh shit." Oh, 
Ooh. High risk. He planned for this and could still rally. Trying to get him back in the ring. We'll slide back in the ring now. He's begging him to get up so he can put him back down. Grand Metalik looking helpless to every attack. Yeah, Metalik has to be a good plan here. See if we can do this. On your feet. Oh yeah, that's a perfect setup for the SIG. Let's go. And we're feeling edgy. We're feeling edgy. Outsider's Edge, baby. Or the Outlaw's Edge is what I like to call it because I'm using it. Let's go. Kicked out. That was more than close. That was inches away from three. Hmm. Interesting. I think he's the first one to kick out of that. And the kick out leads to a tap out. I'm just saying. That was just a preview of what's in store for you, JV. Right, Bobby? That's right. There are repercussions when you insult my lady and think you're too good to form an alliance with us you're going to pay um how about i find a partner and we what and we settle settle it in the ring if you can find someone who can stand teaming with you then you have yourself a match i can't be the only one you two approach to be a part of your power trio any takers they asked me to, JV. Clearly desperate. I'll help you. I'll help you show them they're not in our league. Oh, okay. Ooh, Josie. I would have said said no to them too had they asked, but I heard good things about you, so I'm willing to help you out. Hey, hey, Josie, what is good, girl? Ah, uh, see, Baszler. I'm still looking to get some wins back against Dana Brooke, so count me in. Actually, let me go with Josie Jane. I've heard good things about you too, Josie, from our connections at the PC. Happy to have you on my side. Let's take these loonies down. Good luck with that. Hey, why not have some continuity from the female My Rise story? Bring that over into the male My Rise, you know what I'm saying? With someone who's actually in both my rise stories bruh you know what i'm saying and we, we got a connection there we got the pc connection you know what i'm saying and by pc i mean performance center not the other pc i'm just saying the look at that is scheduled for yo we make a dope team on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 387 pounds the outlaw jason j that means the female My Rise story is canon. Let's go. Oh, crap. Damn, Bobby. Damn it, Bobby. That move ain't right. Okay, come on. Come on. That didn't hurt. Get up. Get off me. Right on your chrome dome. Let's go. You like to hurt people, Bobby? I like to hurt people, too. We got that in common. Let's go. Oh, my bad, Josie. I didn't mean to throw Bobby your way. I'll try to do the rebound. Or the pullback rebound.
Your punk ass up. I was trying to throw him to the post, man. What the hell, man? Looks like he has his finger on the trigger now. Five. All right, back in the ring. Ah, get the punk ass up. I ain't done with you yet. Alright, I'm gonna let Josie get some action. These women have been chopping at the bit and now they're about to throw down. Oh, I like that move. That was dope. She starts to rise back up, but does she know where she is? <laughs> Wrong corner, Bobby. Damn it, Bobby. That boy ain't right. Damn it. What other moves she has? Alright, let's try this again. Alright. Yes, we got Bobby stunned. And she tapped. <laughs> Dana tap. No. Here are your winners. The outlaw, Jason J. V. Yeah, me and Joseph make a dope team, man. Let's go. I was just thinking, man, how dope would it be if the male My Rise, you know what I mean, just runs into the female My Rise to create a wrestler? I know that's asking for too much. You know what I mean, they probably didn't think that far ahead. I'm just saying that would be dope. If you can have both your female and male My Rise characters meet up, you know what I'm saying? That'd be dope. So while Bobby and Dana are such a strong power couple in WWE that they lost to me and my partner teaming together for the first time ever. Hashtag relationship goals. <laughs> so you lucked out in the big... In, you looked out of the tag match, JV, but it won't happen again. Face me one-on-one, -on -one, tough guy. Who you think you are, man? Ha has talk Jim Duggan? <laughs> <laughs> tough guy? Uh, fine. But not walking into a trap, Bobby. We'll have my new partner out there for backup. Bring whoever you want. Doesn't matter. I'm still going to beat you. That's right, Bobby. You're going to shut JV up once and for all. Show him why he was never power tri power trio material. I mean, I was like like my dude said, I was your top choice. Yeah. So clearly, you thought I was power trio material because y'all you approach me. You know what I'm saying? You approach me. You came to me and asked me, and I said no. And apparently, you don't take rejection very well. Which is more of a you problem than it is a me problem. I'm just saying. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by Josie J. From San Jose, California. Weighing in at 267 pounds. The outlaw, Jason J. V. That's dope. I like how they got Josie Jane escorting me to the ring. That's fire. I just love the continuity, man. I love continuity. That means, like like I said, the female My Rise story is canon. Now, just because it's canon, that doesn't mean it's happened before this, all this stuff right here. No. I say both the female My Rise story is happening around the same time the male My Rise story is happening. Because Josie is on SmackDown on both the female My Rise and now the male My Rise story. So, there you go. 
Come on, Bubba. I'm not seeing any objectives, so I don't know. This can go out of the way. You're going after the legs. You're taking away that stamina. Stamina! Oh, crap. Uh-uh. Damn it. Uh-uh. No. No. Damn it. Stop it. Stop it. Get off of me. Punk. Almighty my ass. Oh, hell. No. Stop it, no. Oh, yes, we countered. Took too long. What's up? Perfect setup. I think we got the perfect setup here. Oh, we got two finishers. We got one more for the road. Dunskis. Here is your winner, the outlaw. I knew they weren't gonna let me celebrate with Josie, so we I didn't mind skipping that. Power trio story complete. I think that would be a perfect stopping point for this video, guys. So uh yeah, really hope you guys enjoyed this one as much as I did. And uh, be sure to let me know about the likes, comments, and of course subscribe if you're new here, if you're feeling the vibes. If you're digging what I'm doing over here, that would be greatly appreciated. Don't forget, of course, to check out uh, all the links in the video description down below. That would be greatly appreciated. And, yeah, until the next one, y'all have a blessed one. All right. Peace.